From inside one of Algerian cultural monuments in the heart of the city of lights, Paris, the ghost of the late Ahmed al-Harashi returned to resound in the throat of his son, Kamel. <laughs> the masterpiece Yaray Ahmed Msafir and others from the legacy of the deceased Algerian popular song resounded in the place in celebration of the National Day of the Algerian Artist on which art and creativity are celebrated both within the nation's borders and beyond with the echoes of his timeless melodies. Comme vous le savez, c'est la journée nationale de l'artiste et fêter cette occasion avec c'est quand même As you know, this day marks the national day of the artist and we celebrate this occasion with Kamal Harashi, the successor of his father, Dahman al-Harashi. The audience was happy. It was an opportunity to meet here in Paris, and it was an occasion to get closer to our heritage and culture with a great artist. As you saw, the hall was full, the atmosphere was Algerian capital, and the show was still ongoing. As a musician, composer and author, Al-Harashi left behind a rich artistic legacy and a son who presents his songs, continuing the path of his father, who was one of the creators of Algerian popular songs. I am very happy that I am with you today, and I was honored by the presence of Mr. Ambassador, very happy and grateful that I could not find the words to express it. The atmosphere was full of joy, and everyone was happy. The concert brought together the Algerian community in France with their beloved to enjoy and relieve their memories with his masterpieces and an opportunity to others to discover the Algerian musical heritage. We are very happy to be here today. It's a good opportunity to meet the Algerian community here in France. It's a good opportunity for our children to get to know our heritage and culture as well. This is a big and wonderful moment that we all share together today here in Paris. It was really a great show. To these tunes, the audience danced and sang and the fans of the little Harashi interacted with his father's great legacy, so that this concert was more than just a tune and a melody, but rather a part of homeland and identity.